At the end of the day, so many people, despite what they do have, they are mentally losing it over what they don't have because they've never really discovered what was the hope of their calling in Christ Jesus. And since sometimes it's easier to know people than it is to know God, we, we start measuring ourselves by one another and by what, by what we think other people expect from us rather than measuring ourselves by God and what he expects from us. And the Bible says that comparing ourselves to ourselves is a very foolish thing to do. It is unwise because it's unwise to compare yourself with anybody because we are all created for different purposes. Let me, let me tell you something about Cheryl Brady. You will never, ever, ever have to worry about me flipping out, starving myself, trying to become some kind of supermodel. It ain't going to happen. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to kill myself trying to be skinny because I see somebody else's skinny. It's, it's, a, it's a mess what people are going through, even in the church. We're killing ourselves trying to be a five, a seven, or nine. And nobody in your family has ever been a five, a seven, or a nine. Your mama is not a five, a seven, or a nine. Your, your aunts, your sisters, your cousins, ain't nobody in your family skinny. As a matter of fact, skinny is not even in your DNA. What in the name of God are you trying to do to yourself? Forget about it. Bring your plus self size on into the house of the Lord and give him a plus size praise and say, devil, you are a liar. Whether you are a 2 or a 22, get up off yourself and make everybody else get up off of you too. Just say, excuse me, I'm fearfully and wonderfully made and I got to have room to praise him. <laughs>